Okay. That was kind of scary. Um. I got a sword out here. So there's a blackout. I'm experiencing a blackout. And I just saw all the lights just flash back on really fast and then like burn out back, burn back out. There's the moon. So it's like two, two ten in the morning around like, oh, there's somebody over there. They have dogs. I think I might know who that is. Anyways, around two, two in the morning, one fifty something. All the lights went out here in, uh, well, might as well say it. You guys already know. Kind of, I saw those sirens. There's like red lights. Something's going on out here. It's October. Grapevine. I'm here in Grapevine, Texas. It's about 2. 2 in the morning. Somewhere around 3.50 something. Or 2. 2 through 2. Oh, 03. The power went out. Everywhere. The brightest thing is the moon. It's a waxing gibbous, I believe. It's 2021, you know, October. Um. 23rd. Really early in the morning, really late at night, depends on how you look at it. It's super dark out here. Well, there's a little bit of light from the moon. And I just saw the lights flicker on. It's kind of scary out here. I got it. I'll be honest, I got a little spooked when I was in my room and the lights just went off. I'm just kind of standing here. You can't see anything because the camera kind of doesn't pick it up. You can see the lights from the sky over there, past the trees. I got a sword. I don't know if you can see that. Well, it looks pretty cool in the dark. I'm just kind of standing here. My back is open. I kind of shouldn't be standing on my back. It could be open during a blackout, but you know, it is what it is. I see people in their houses with their lights. I saw one over there. It's so dark. I don't think I'll get on my shoes and have a look. I'm out here in my socks. The ground's kind of wet. I don't want to get my socks wet. So I'm just standing here in this one spot. I like how this looks through my eyes, though, you know. My camera can't pick it up, but my eyes can. I can see in the dark a little bit here. I can't see in the darkest corners, like over there above those stairs. I kind of jumped back a little when the lights came back on. They only flickered back on for a split second. Not even a second, like one fourth of a second, one fifth of a second. They just kind of blew up. I just heard a big <laughs> and all the lights came on for like a, a split, split second. Split of a split second. This is going to be kind of a long video, I think. Oh, why not? We'll take a little bit of a walk.
kind of dark. Kind of really dark. You know, that kind of dark, it's kind of spooky. And the grass is wet. Great. I see the pose even offline. Usually it's doing its little fountain thing. I see a little bit of light coming from that generator looking thing over there. That light switch. Don't know what that could be. Maybe, maybe there's some kind of emergency power system in there. Yeah. Oh, my eyes are starting to get brighter with my eyes. I can hear the train still. So the train's still going off. The train's still doing its thing. I needed a little walk. I kind of went... Uh. The reason I'm up so late right now is because I kind of went to sleep earlier than I should have. About like 7 or 8. And I ended up waking up about 12. Trying to sleep for 2 hours in my bed with a little bit of insomnia there. Then out of nowhere, all the lights turn off just... Those more lights from fire brigade, or fire truck, or something, police car. I have a sword out here for a little bit of protection, you know, in case, because it is a blackout. Nothing good happens during a blackout. I'm kind of just wandering this apartment complex. The scenery's great though. I'm really liking this dark scenery lit up by the moon. Oh, I see some power. Let's go towards it. Oh man, especially it being October. There's a 13 on the ground there. Ooh boy. And it's a blackout. Oh, I saw something over there. Something dark. Someone running? I don't like that. I saw it through my peripheral vision. There was just a black blur moving across that area. I'll turn your back on it. I had my back turned on it. I don't know if you can see this. If this is at all able to be picked up. Right, here comes someone. What a blackout. I'm just out here in my socks with a sword. I mean, I'm in Texas, you can do that, I guess. I'm pretty sure any blade is fair game. You can just walk around with it, it doesn't matter. No one's going to stop you. It's only the actions you cause with the blade that people can stop you for. But I'm not out here to cause harm. Just to check things out. That would be... I would walk that way, but that would be moving towards that uh, black blur I saw. There's something going on over there. I don't know if you can see that. It's like an emergency light or something. 
Something's going on out here. There's something over there. I don't know what that is. It might be a person. I could be jump scared. At a moment's notice. There's somebody's car lights coming on. Somebody's exiting the vehicle. Interesting. I should probably go the other way. This is interesting. I hear many police sirens in the distance. It's dead silent other than the sound of crickets. And cars. And police sirens. There's some wind over that way. Look at that, that looks like a snapshot for a horror game. You can even see a star in the sky, like. Is that a star? What in the world is that? It's like flashing blue and white. Let me zoom in on that. What is that? I've got no freaking clue. It isn't moving. Is it a comet? What the heck is that? It's so bright. It's flashing multiple colors. No, no, it's just red and white. Well, it's kind of multiple colors. White is a... Uh, Spectrum of light, I believe. It's so strange. Everything's strange tonight. Different from the usual. Okay. A little bit of wind. Something weird is definitely going on here. More stars are being seen because of this blackout. That's nice, it's always a good touch. I'm afraid to go any further. Oh, there's some light coming from over there. All right, I'll check it out. I'll be brave. Let's be silent too. As I can. Stink leaves are making it kind of hard. There goes a car. It's a Jeep. Sorry, I'm not getting it very well. Oh, there's something going on down there. So it's like, um, about two in the morning. There's people going everywhere. I don't know what's going on. There's another car coming this way. There's another car going out that way. There's another car coming back. I don't want to get too close to whatever happened down there. I'm just gonna get a close shot, I'm just gonna get a clear shot of it and then zoom in to show you what's happening. Looks like there's a bunch of police over there and I have a huge sword. So, I don't know if I wanna get very close to them. I only have the sword out here because it's a blackout and I wanted to see what's happening and I didn't wanna go out unarmed. I'm gonna sit here because it looks like I got a pretty good shot of it here. Hmm, it's kind of hard to see, isn't it? Hey. Live here. Huh? Live here. Yeah. Think somebody had a pole up there. What? You think somebody had a pole? Yeah, I, I see that. That's that's I mean, interesting. Man, dude, there's like 20 of them at the end 
Really? Somebody hit a power line? I think so, yeah, bro. Because, you know, where a park is like parked in the park? Yeah. It's fucking. It's That's interesting. I was kind of hesitant to come out here. I'm hesitant to drive back there. Fuck. Coming out here is fine, but I'm hesitant to drive back there. Yeah. No, I'm literally sitting right there. I just kind of wanted to see what's happening. Because it, like. It's the same they got you right there. I mean, I would go check it out, but I've got a huge sword now. I don't know how how they would react to that. I said I've got a huge sword right here. I don't know how they'd react to that. I just got settled in too. You just moved here? No, I said I just got settled in for the night. I'm about to chill out. Oh, oh yeah. I got off at like 11.30, you know what I'm saying? That happened at like... Two in the morning. Two, two, like flat, like right at two. Yep. I was uh, just in my room when it happened, and I, I saw Xbox. all. I suddenly just went blind. I was like, "What?" Yeah. Sure. It started to come back on for a minute there. Yeah, I know. It was like. And then nothing. So, I do that just a few minutes ago. I think somebody hit a pole. Yeah. As soon as I saw that, like that, that flash, that flicker. That huge, like, uh, that explosion, kind of. I just, like, I kind of, not explosion, like, a, like the explosion of light everywhere. That, like, like that, tsh. I didn't see that. Oh, well, that's what, you, when the lights came back on for a second? They, they tried to come on, but in my apartment, they never came on. Oh, well, I saw the lights out in the park area, the uh, park area, like, like, over in the, with the benches and everything. I saw that, and it was like, it went, psh. Is that a cop right there? I don't think so. I think that's a, oh, it might be a cop. I don't know. I see a lot of red and blue flashing lights down there. <laughs> you live in Woodlake or the barn? Uh, I live down there. I live in Woodlake. Right Up there? I live on that side. I live Where past... They're way out down there. Where are... I live past the, uh, the flagpoles over by the... The... You know the fucking mailboxes are? Yeah. I live past there. Yeah, I live past there. Shit, this happened last fucking month, bro. This happened last month too? Two months ago, I think shit. Oh, I didn't notice I wasn't here. Oh, you weren't? No. Yeah, I live on that side and the whole fucking thing at two in the morning. Wham. Exactly two in the morning again? Yeah, Seems to be a pattern then, huh? That's a rush for me, bro. They wouldn't put their fucking things on the sides. I wonder how long how long was it last time before it was resolved? Eight in the morning. Eight in the morning? Yeah. Might be the same time again. Uh-huh. I have to go stay at a fucking hotel. Fuck this shit. It looks like the lights are working fine on the street. Really? Yeah, the street lights are fine. And all these apartments are out. Is it just the apartments? Because, I mean... I think it might just be the apartment. I can see light across the street. Okay. The house across the street have light. Yeah, it's probably just this side then. That's interesting. I haven't seen a blackout in a while. Yeah, no shit, right? Did you live Did you live here last February? Yeah. We didn't lose power then either during the storm? No, I don't think we... No, we didn't lose power no, during we didn't. it. No, we didn't. I see multiple police just walking around up there. They're walking around? Yeah. You see police walking around? I see one. Around? He went behind the... Uh, or over, over towards the... Uh, yeah, he's talking to the people inside the uh, the electrical car. Oh, shit. Dude, there's so many fucking cops at the end of the road. Not this road, but the other road. Just the one by Perry's Steakhouse? No, you know where fucking Subway is on this road right here? Yeah, yeah that's uh, the plaza where uh, Perry's Steakhouse is, right? Perry's over there, bro. No, Perry's is over that way. Oh, uh, is it? Yeah. 
yeah, it's like the highway over there. It's like you go up this way and then you turn right. Yeah. Back in the darkness, boys. You get to see the full feature length cut on YouTube of this whole incursion happening, this whole thing going on. Maybe I'll go around the church in the darkness. Is that guy coming? I think that guy's coming back. But uh, I'll stop the video then. I kind of needed to come out to walk anyways. My amnesia was getting kind of... My amnesia. My um, restlessness was getting kind of annoying. So I kind of... A little, a little walk outside is good. It'll cause me to go back to sleep when I get back inside. brought a sword. It's kind of dull. I'm going to be honest, but it's got a nice point. I kind of want to get a shot of all the cops down the street. I got this blade here. I don't know if you can see that. Just have it in case. I mean, since there's a lot of cops nearby, I don't think I'm gonna. I don't think I'm in any real danger. But just in case, you never know. It's dark. Oh, well, something's happening. Yeah, I might go around the church here in a sec. Ow. This road is not for feet. I'm not wearing any shoes. Still not wearing any shoes. I'm not going to go all the way up there. I'm just going to cross the street here. There's, there's a lot of them. I don't know if you can see from down here. But I'm just, I'm going to go across the, I'm going to go around the church so as to not really be seen by much people. Because I have a huge honking blue sword. Almost looks like an enchanted diamond sword. <laughs> but I'm gonna go here around this church and try to get a shot of all the police, all the police cars down the street. Oh, that dip. I don't know if you can see it now. There's like cops everywhere down that way. Oh, even down there. There's police everywhere. And I look like a miner. I'm not. But, uh, they'll definitely question me if they see me. And I don't have my ID on me either, so. I'm, as far as I'm aware, it's perfectly legal, though questionable to have a huge sword or a gun walking around out in public, especially late at night. It's a little sketchy. And honestly, it's a little bit sketchy walking around this dark. I mean, it's kind of light in there, actually. There's some light inside the church. I don't know if you can see that. I don't think the cameras are picking that up. But, uh... I don't know. It's kind of, it's still kind of dark back here. Jump scare in three, two, one. <laughs> Just imagine. 
That'd be kind of scary. Definitely wouldn't be expecting it. Come to think of it, you know, I actually, I left my lightsaber uh, prop, the one that lights up. I had it in my hand. I left it on a bush outside. Um, I should probably go retrieve it once this is over. Once I go back. Look, the, the houses across the way have light. It's just this little block here that doesn't... Um... Okay, hold on, the lighting is getting a bit harsh. I'm gonna leave my sword here because I think it's pretty safe. Oh lord, it's so bright. Oh lord, oh lord. Yeah, somebody hit a pole. Oh, it's dark all the way down there. I don't want to get any closer. Wow. Let's get a shot of this. I don't know if you can see that. I don't know if you can see that, but that looks pretty cool. All right, time to get home. There's my old little sword. Well, it's pretty big, actually. It's like... 30 inches. It's made of stainless steel. It's tinted blue. And I'm just walking around with it like it's nothing. It doesn't weigh much. Maybe like a pound or two, three pounds. It's not a sword. It's not a sword for belligerent. Uh, for belligerent attacks. It's more like for stealthy kind of. I don't know why. I just have it, okay? I like to play I like to play fruit ninja. I like to play fruit ninja with it. So the walk back home is going to be about the same. Except I'm going to be less scared because I know there's nothing that's going to attack me out here. I probably should have just came with my shoes and no sword. But uh, yeah, that's my night tonight. Somebody struck a light, uh, somebody struck a pole somewhere down down the street I think around uh, near the near the Shell's gas station or not, not Shell's Exxon Chevron whatever it's called yeah somebody struck the light down there around 2 a.m. And all the lights on this side of the street onward kind of just blew out. And now we don't have power until probably 8 in the morning. Well, that's all fine. I don't mind. My phone's mostly charged. As long as the 5G towers is still up, I'm good. I probably won't wake up till like 12 in the afternoon anyways. But the walk home is going to be pretty much most of the same stuff. That guy's still down there. I don't know what he's doing. I'm just going to go straight back home. But, uh, yeah. 
that's my day. At this point, I'm just recording in case anything does happen. Because uh, the reason I actually started recording is because of... Oh, because of... Um, when I, like I was talking to that guy, I said, the lights kind of just psh, turned on for a split second. That's the reason I started recording. The lights scared me. But yep, this whole block here and all the way down forward doesn't have power. Oh, and all the way backwards. So Perry's Steakhouse doesn't have power. Subway doesn't have power. The beer and wine store doesn't have power. That also means the security systems are offline. So I'm not going to go do anything, but I'm just saying somebody could do something. Somebody could go in there and the security cam cameras are off. And the security alarm and everything's off. Offline. That goes for here, too. The only security people have right now is their locks on their doors. It's a good thing there isn't... It's a good thing there isn't any, um... Crazed villains running about. Especially here in Grapevine. Now, if this was Oak Cliff, a blackout would be extremely dangerous and I would not be able to walk out. <laughs> That's strange. That's scary. But anyways, yep, that's my night. Looks like the wind has stopped. Because these flags are stopping. Ow. I just hit my kneecap with the edge of my sword. That hurt, kinda. It hurt even more if I wasn't wearing jeans. Okay. Let's see if I can get that shot one more time. Yeah, this is a long video. I don't blame you if you don't want to see the whole thing. I know you're watching, my time. I know you're watching. <laughs> this has been interesting. There's some dead trees around that make the shadows and it looks kind of scary. There's a car there, there's a car here, there's a car there, there's a car there, there's a car there, there's a car there. I'm back in the parking lot near my own, near my house. Something sounds weird this way. I did kind of see an explosion. It was more like an explosion of light, though. It wasn't really a real explosion explosion like It was more like a Like a power surge. Yep, my lightsaber's still here. Look how dark it is. You can only see the lightsaber. Okay, but I kind of needed to get in. Did you see anything? Yep. Yeah. 